Um, but before we start, guys, let me hear you. Uh, let me know if you hear me better because I was close the door because the rain was so hard tonight. It's just starting pouring rain um, by the time I start my live stream. So, yeah, guys. Let me know, you guys. Is it clear my camera? My audio? I don't know, guys. Let me know if you hear me better. Uh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Okay, I know someone's there already, but um, please don't forget to uh, join our live chat, guys. Anyone drop some questions? Yeah, I know someone's there already. Uh, let me know, you guys, if you hear me better. My connection, I don't know. Whoa, the rain is so, so hard by the time I start my live stream. Okay, we're waiting for the others. I was wearing my eyeglasses because I had a headache tonight, guys. And that's I think because of my eyes. So yeah, um, Mikai Mayor's there already. Mayong gabi sa yo sis. Asa ka sa Bisaya sis. Okay, shout out to you, Michai. From I don't know where are you, Michai? But let me know, Dai, if um, sakto lang ba? My voice, I don't know. I think it <laughs> sounds like echo because I was close. The door, it's so rainy, guys. And it's like, there's a lightning and thunder. Ooh, see that? Oh, God, it's a lightning. <laughs> oh no, the Pitan. Okay, from the Pitan City, Michai. Then makadumu ka ka dahi. Sakto lang ba ang audio? I don't know. What fix it? Oh, it's pouring rain. You know, it's like scared of the lightning and thunder. Okay, um, please uh, don't, don't be hesitate guys to join our live chat tonight. I know uh, people is there already. Someone's there, but please join our live chat guys. Oh no, please rain, rain, move on. Dai, wala, diri wala pamatay. Yeah, uh, karon na juday na sugod. By the time may magsugod na kung live, may ibundak magulan, may god, napagit kidlat. So lightning and thunder, oh my god, please. Ah. Cedric Edwards, hello, good evening, Cedric, how are you? What's the news? How was uh, things going in Laguna? What's the update? Yes, good evening. How was your Sunday, um, Cedric Edwards? Okay, I think um, Someone is sleeping already, or they sleep already because look at that. If you hear the rain, guys, it's like, oh no, pouring rain. Please stop. Okay, that's good news. Stop. <laughs> Slow down. Calm down, rain. Nothing's new yet. Yeah, it is. You have to wait when it's that time. We're gonna wait. 
Yes. Uh, still waiting. All we had to do is um, lots of patience at this time. Oh no, oh my god, this ring. the others and don't forget to give me a thumbs up guys I appreciate it and please join our live chat which is Filipino blogger is here you know it's always good to see you uh, having a live chat to talk to my subscribers you know uh, an update, you know, guys. If you want some questions or anything that you'd like to know, and I'm here to talk to you every Sunday, every Sunday at 9 p.m. Philippine time. Okay, I appreciate it. Thank you so much for the thumbs up. Okay, wrap. Rock Jamra is in the house now. Good morning to you, Rock Jamra. How was your Sunday going? Yeah, it's a beautiful morning for you, but look at our evening here. It's like pouring rain. There's a lightning and thunder. Oh no. Yeah, and how was your Sunday going, uh, Rock Jamra? Hey you guys, um, is that okay? My voice is not sounds echo because I'm like <laughs> in a room and I close everything. So once the rain was stopped and no lightning will open the door. Because I was scared of the lightning, so I would close my door. <laughs> Ooh. And it's a thunderstorm. All right, guys. How was your Sunday going, Rock Jam Rock? No plans to go out with this beautiful uh, morning. I think the rain was stuck. I almost miss your live stream because. They turned the clock back one hour last night. Daylight saving time. Ah, all right. Because we call your, uh, how do you call that? Daylight saving time, you call in your country. Wow. And by the way, what time is it now in your country? I think it's too early. Yeah, I think some of my subscribers are sleeping yet <laughs> because of that daylight saving time. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, but I'm here. Um, it's 8.15 a.m. Ah, okay. That's good. So it's good to um, some of you guys woke up the time and it's good to have a cup of coffee. Yeah, it's Sunday morning to you guys. All right. Um, Yeah, Mapo is in the house already. Good evening to you. How are you? It's good to see you here in my live stream. Uh, 
Are you single? Yes, I am. I'm still single, guys. All right. Uh, guys, please uh, don't hesitate to join my live chat. It's free, guys. You know, don't be shy if you want uh, some questions or you clarify with Filipino blogger. I am just here, guys. All right, Nigel is in the house already. Uh, good evening to you, Nigel. It's good to see you again. How are you? How was your uh, Sunday going, Nigel? Yes, thank you for giving a thumbs up, guys. I appreciate it. Thank you so much for uh, giving me a thumbs up. I had few um, people in here join our live chat, but um, I hope everyone there will join. It's free to shout out, guys. <laughs> Nicholas Darden, hello, um, welcome. It's good to see you, Nicholas. How are you? How are things going in uh, South Africa? How, what's your uh, any plans your Sunday? Um, I'm all good today. I was just working, so yeah, just kind of. Filipino vloggers live um, every day working six days a week. But yeah, thanks God, you know. Um, everything's all good. All right, rock drum rock. Before COVID, did you have a lot? of tourism in the polo yes they have lots in here guys not only in by the city of the polo but you know just um travel like um uh, an hour and yeah there are lots of um uh, place that you would like to uh travel to tour tourist place here in the polo yeah, before COVID, guys, there, there are lots, you know, open for the tourists. But since COVID, oh no. It's bad. But, no. That rain. Hope you're fine. Yes, I am fine, Nigel. Thank you so much. Thanks, God. I'm all good. Rock Jamra, how is the bathroom coming along? Um, today, Uncle Jonas is still working. Uh, he just worked every Sunday, guys, my Uncle Jonas, because he had another job also in other places. So only Sunday that he had a vacant. So that's the time. He will uh, fix our bathroom. So today he was there working. Um, he just let me know that he will start working today. So yeah, by on this my day off when I go visit, I'm gonna um, let you an update on our bathroom. Nigel, it. Is it raining outside? Yes, you hear that raining. It's not only raining hard, but there's a lightning and thunderstorm. So I was close my door here. I want to see the lightning outside, guys. I was scared. <laughs> I was scared about lightning. Yeah, Nicholas, I'm glad everything is good here in South Africa. My only plan is do video chat with my girlfriend after watching your live and rest. Oh yeah, 
that's a good for now you know this only way that you guys communicate with your girlfriend video chat but all we had to do is uh, patient lots of patient at this time yeah and one day we don't know uh, things always change and you guys will travel hopefully guys hopefully Uh, and it's good to hear about your girlfriend and Nicholas. Um, you don't mind if let me know where is from your girlfriend. Is it in Mindanao or in Manila? But I appreciate your if you want um, a private uh, Nicholas, but yeah. That's okay with that. Yes, it is. But yeah, if you read that, it's kind of stopped to rain and it's suddenly it's pouring rain and with the lightning. Yeah. Hopefully, it will stop. I will open the door. Yes, please. Um, don't hesitate to join a live chat guys or just friend in here open you know sharing some ideas you know especially um, Western or Filipino yeah we're just friends in here guys so anyone would like to know let us share our ideas. Oh, friends, okay. Hi, pretty lady. Hello to you. Welcome. Welcome to my live stream. Where are you from, all oh, friends? This way it's like so crazy. And yeah, and I I appreciate your thumbs up guys. Thank you so much. It's good to see, you know, um that you guys you know i'm um, joining my live stream and with uh, talking to you every sunday it always it always good in my feelings that we had a time like this you know um we talk we seeing you even i'm not seeing you or just here uh sharing your ideas and opinions and we talk about anything so it's just always uh, it's good in my uh, feelings that I talk every Sunday. So Monda Bill is in here. Hello, Mary from Australia. My sister lives in Santa Rosa Laguna. Wow. Uh, Welcome to my live stream, Moga Bill from Australia. Well, it's good to see you here. And yeah, shout out to your sister. Is is she um married in Santa Rosa or they just have a tourist in Philippines? Santa Rosa, that's Laguna. Santa Rosa Laguna. Yes, I was been there before in Santa Rosa Laguna. My past, uh, for my past job, that was in SM, SM Santa Rosa Laguna, way back 2007. Yeah. Anyway, Mogabil, um, where are you now? Are you still in Australia or? You're having 
vacation or you're stuck here in Philippines, I'm stuck here. <laughs> you're in Philippines. Okay, Ram Jamrak. I hear they're getting more people vaccinated. So they may open tourism soon. Yes, hopefully it will, but um, there are lots of people uh, still not yet fully vaccinated. So, um, but some people, it's not kind of, they don't want it, you know, but we will see guys what, you know, things are always strange. So hopefully everyone's get vaccinated so that they will open the tourists. One day, hopefully, guys. My sister and I share the same OC that. Ah. Okay. Mm. So, have you been also in here in Philippines, small W? Or did you travel around Philippines? And how was the time when you exploring? All your subscribers will be coming to see you. <laughs> yeah, you know, it's good in my feelings that you guys seeing me in Vipassa <laughs> just said, Hi, Filipino blogger. Yeah, I've always been there working. Anyway, you will see me every day except on my days off because I have lots to do when I go visit my mom. Yes and hopefully guys see you. We'll see you in here. <laughs> see you in here. I'm Australian. My sister is Filipino. Oh okay you're Australian. Mm. So that means your mom is Filipina. Not yet. Ah, oh, but how come? Is it? Well, I thought you were a visit already here, Moga. But have you any? Um, have you plan to travel in Philippines or not yet? Hoping to visit soon. Yes, hopefully. Hopefully, guys, you will. You guys will visit in Philippines once the uh, travel ban lifted. Yes. Okay, see you. See you in Philippines. Yes. <laughs> the plaza will be packed every day. <laughs> I think so, and uh, once, you know, travel ban lifted, I think there may now lots of um, Westerner in the plaza, you know. We don't know, like, before guys, when no pandemic, I seen couples of um, foreigners shopping in the plaza. But since pandemic, just few, few foreigners come here, like today, there are two um, foreigners sat down having a coffee in a bread world's bakery. Yeah, but this is before, before, before with no pandemic, there are lots of foreigners in the polo. But hopefully guys, yeah, one day, we'll see, see you. Like I said, rock jump rock, lip lots of hack. <laughs> We'll be back every day of a uh, Westerner, <laughs> foreign, foreigner. Now we will see, guys. Moldavia, my dad, my dad beat a woman in 1980s while working there. Oh, I see. So that means you are Australian but half 
Filipino to uh, Moldavia. We uniformed each other two years ago. Um, so where is your parents? Is here in Santa Rosa? Santa Rosa Laguna? sister from um, your wife a uh, Filipina ah okay yeah that's what I mean it's just your half sister it's Filipina mm. wow just my sister ah okay Mm, that's good. It's good to hear that more of you. Well, um, rock jam rock. There are lots of foreigners in the Maggeti. Yes, I've seen. I've I've never been to the Maggeti, but I've seen couple of vlogs. You know, because I like watching vlogs on YouTube and the lots of foreigners in the Maggeti. visit in Philippines. Uh, Mongabio. I was, I was confused. You just met uh, how many years? You just found two years ago? And what is that happened? You don't know that you have a sister here in Philippines? Or what about your parents? Where do you live? In Australia? Oh god, this rain! Oh no! So, this has been recent rain, uh, pouring rain like this, guys. You know, it's like a week I could not sleep when I hear the noise. It's like pouring rain. My mom and dad have us. Oh, I'm sorry for your uh, loss, um, all the bill. Yeah, hopefully one day you will meet with your sister in Santa Rosa Laguna. It seems that uh, some people are scared to visit Mindanao, but it's beautiful there. Yes, that's, I don't know, um, I don't know, some people will be widely scared, you know, scared to travel when they heard Mindanao. Or it's like, uh, really scared of Mindanao, why? There are lots of foreigners in here living with a, uh, a family with a wife. And I have also a uh, new subscriber in here, Gary, if you watching this vlog, Gary. Gary is married, uh, not married, it's not married yet, but they have a living partner in here. It's, uh, it's in, not in the city, it's just close to mountain areas, guys, in, uh, I forgot, Mutia. It's not really a uh, mountain, but... It's far from here in the whole of city. It's just, I think, an hour to travel, but I'm not far to travel. Uh, no, it's just an hour to travel from mountain. And to just, you know, safe, you know, and he was always traveling. I see a couple foreigners in here, they are safe guys, you know. 
Mindanao is uh, is a massive, you know, province, guys. So there are parts that you might scared, not uh, good for foreigners, but I think there are every in our country they have that, you know, um, food people with bad people, you know. Not only in Mindanao, guys, but I don't know. I assure you that once you been here, and yeah, you just see because once you uh, drop from the airport of the Polo, just around here in the Polo, guys, you are like really safe, guys. Mogabil, she came to Australia three years ago. It was wonderful. Wow, I thought you uh, never met with your sister, but yeah, it's good to hear that you know uh, you've been had a time bonding with your sister. Wow. So hopefully, uh, one day you will see back together with your sister. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I apologize. I know some of you don't. Uh, like to hear this noisy, this noisy rain. That rain is heavy. Does it rain that heavy often? Yes, it is. It is like pouring rain. It's like this, guys. If you hear that, yeah, it's pouring rain. like an echo <laughs> if you hear that because I was in my room so anyway guys um Gorgian Ingman is here hello Mr. Gorgian Ingman from Sweden shout out to you thank you Mr. Gorgian for giving a time how are you today Say hello to your wifey. Is it is she working today, uh, Mr. Gorgian? Let's send in regards also. Little Mar is in the house. Good evening to you. Good, good evening. Good morning. But I was confused. I was always confused with your time, guys. But. <laughs> Yeah, it was good to see you, little Mark. Yes, it's very bad weather today, but you know what? This morning and in a work, having a lunch break until I finish work, it's, it's, we had a nice weather. It's so bright and sunny today. The only thing is pouring rain when about to start my live stream. So that's the kind of video we had here in Philippines, guys. Always change. It is sunny and suddenly it's pouring rain in a few minutes. So that's crazy weather we had here. Rock Jam Rock, your subscribers in America didn't change their clock back yet. They are still sleeping. Yeah, I think so. They are sleeping. Sunday it's rest day, so I think so. And they don't set the alarm yet, <laughs> I forgot. Hey guys, Filipino vloggers, time live stream. <laughs> but anyway, um, hopefully they were uh, watching the replay. If they're sleeping yet. 
Nigel, sorry I am cooking. It's okay, Nigel. Don't say sorry. I I still appreciate your time, even your busy in your cooking. What did you cook today, Nigel? Sounds yummy. Well, thank you so much, Nigel. What does Ate mean? Ate, that means uh, a lady or you just kind of respect when you when you say Ate, it's just kind of respect the woman that, you know, older, it's not older, it's just because some people, it's not kind of older, even younger, they call Ate because it's a kind of respect call for a woman, yeah, they call Ate. When it's a uh, boy, you say Puya. Yeah, Ate and Puya. That's the Tagalog, uh, Tagalog name that you call to the person. Okay, gorgeous Amen. Oh, we are very fine here. Yes, she's working her last day, so she has one week of vacation here in Sweden. Wow, I hear you have a rain. Yeah, and you tell that it's pouring rain. And I don't know if you hear that uh, thunderstorm. Please stop the rain. I was like seeing it here. Yes, respectful to see at your Kuya. Yes, it is. Kuya is a boy, Ate is a girl. I know uh, Mr. Gorgian Inkman will adopt uh, the language or the culture here in Philippines because he was married with a uh, Filipina from below. It's here. It just I think two hours to travel from here in Dipolog to Liloy. Yes, Mr. Gorgian Inman. And he was there all he was here already in the hometown of his wife. So he might adapt the culture and uh, the language that he spoke here in the Philippines. So how was anyway I'd like to ask Mr. Gorgi Inman because he was living here and he was traveling around back to Polo to Litoy. So how was it uh, Mr. Gorgi Inman you joined me that time you live in the Polo in in Litoy, in here in Mindanao. Because uh, some of my subscribers asking you know, they, want, they might scare to travel in Mindanao, but look, Mr. Gorgian Inman was uh, been here traveling around the fall of Tuliluli. Just go on biking. Yes, Mr. Gorgian Inman. <laughs> yes, I have tried to speak and understand the language of the Kinas. Yes. If you wanted, you know, um, speak Bisaya or um, the language that we spoke in Philippines is Tagalog. Yeah, it's easy. I think it's easier when you uh, when you married with Filipina and you guys, you know, it's like in every day you learn the words uh, Tagalog. Yeah, like you know. The every day that you've been spent together, you will adapt or know the language. Mercy call, good evening, CC ringing sa inyo. <laughs> yes, dai, gusto ka yung ulan, mayong gabi iliha. Uh, mercy call, kumusta dai? But anyway, guys, uh, mercy call, CC. Did you put a reply sa imuhang comment for the last video that in my vlog? I don't know. I was twice sending the reply, but I don't know. Did it man mag-appear, guys? 
maybe so settings i don't know what happening last that video delete ko muna reply ni mo dai but twice ko na reply sa ikon comment i don't know what happening yeah anyway ji dai ko so kay ulan diri um din ha wala wala ulan dai I don't speak good yet, but I try time I can. Yeah, and we are gonna meet if you know when you're back in the polo. Wow, thank you so much, Mr. Boyje Inman. I think I was shy. He <laughs> said, I think I was shy. <laughs> I don't know if I will accept Mr. Boyje Inman for that dinner, but I'm shy. I'm shy. Yes, hopefully. You will back here with your wife soon, and we met in person. Anyway, um, one day, Mr. Bojan in man. Rock jam, rock. I am slowly learning some words in Tagalog and Bisayan. Yes, Bisaya or Tagalog. I don't know if you sounds like confused guys because you have two language that you you will learn once you here in Philippines. But it it is okay when you learn um, Tagalog because that's our language speak here in Philippines Tagalog. Everyone will understand. But Bisaya only you will understand if we're here in Mindanao because we speak Bisaya in Mindanao. But if we are, uh, if we go to Manila, people there could not understand our dialect Bisaya, so we speak Tagalog. So I think it's first best way you understand understand Tagalog, or if you want, if you live here in Mindanao and. If it was good when you learn also Bisaya. <laughs> but every day, you know, uh, when you have every day that your lifestyle here in the Philippines with your wife, I think you're gonna adapt know our uh, like what is dialect Bisaya. It's easy to learn, guys. <laughs> it's easy to learn. Like, like your language also English that's why it is it's hard I think it's hard oh god yeah Gorgeous Inman yeah we did celebrate 14 years and married 26th of October see Mr. Gorgeous Inman 14 years married with his wife from Liloy Lilo is a Monga del Norte and he was I think back and forth from here the prologue to Sweden, Mr. Gorgian England, yes. And they were planning to have a vacation but COVID will stop that. But hopefully one day Mr. Gorgian England, I know you uh, you are ready with your wife, your family. To come back in your hometown, your wife's hometown. Anyway, hopefully, uh, Mr. Gorgian, hopefully, we'll see you soon with your wife. And thank you so much for that great invitation dinner with your family. I'm so shy. I'm so shy. I'm so shy. Mr. Gorgian, I'm shy. <laughs> Okay. Um, music San Diego is in the house already. Good evening. I mean, good morning, Music San Diego. It's 5:45 a.m. now here in California. I forgot about the time change. Yes. Um, thank you for letting us know your time in California, Music San Diego. 5.45 a.m. That's not um, too bad early to wake up yet. 
It's not too bad. It's not too early. Music San Diego. <laughs> yes, to be honest, that's all. That time I, you know, um, woke up also like 5:45 or 6 o'clock in the morning. That I will woke up. And if I have a little bit of time to have a nap and I get back to sleep in a few minutes, then um, get up at 7 a.m. for preparing work. So 5 a.m. that's okay, that's not bad. Anyway, how was your Sunday in Music San Diego? How was your Sunday going? Mercy ko, walay ulan dili si Kuman, init pa summer. Bisaya naman. <laughs> init pa summer. Yes, like in the afternoon, it's so sunny. Init kay din niyang uto dili day. When I had my lunch break at 12 noon, it was like, ooh, it was so hot. The sun was so bright. And I don't know, just tonight. Yeah, it's, it's pouring rain. Gorging in money. You don't need to be shy. We can have a nice day and dinner with us, you and friends, if you like. Okay, that would be nice. Yes, hopefully one day, Mr. Gorging in money. We will. <laughs> yes, thank you for that. Uh, great invitation dinner, Mr. Gorge and Iman. Okay, little Mark, I don't know how to remove your message. It's easier to learn Tagalog for foreigner. It's more common dialect there. Yes, that was I said. Um, Tagalog. It's a common dialect that we speak in Philippines. You can understand the Tagalog. My wife speak both Tagalog and Bisaya. Yes, because uh, Tagalog that's our language that we speak in Philippines. So everyone speak Tagalog. Yo, we are looking for a house and lot to buy and settle down in Pinas. Oh, um, which part of you would you like to buy a house and lot, Mr. Gorgian Inman? Because I have, it's not a friend, workmates here in Lee Plaza. He asking me if uh, someone who likes, likes to buy a house and lot here in the Polog. It's not in the proper city of Dipolo, but it's not quite far, guys. All you have to do is try, uh, ride in a trike. So if you guys want interested, but I, I don't know if I have time, I want to vlog that house and lot. I'm going to ask uh, that person that he offers me uh, who wants to buy house and lot. House and lot, I think I forgot. Is it lot or uh, I forgot? I'm gonna ask guys if I see, so I'm gonna ask that about uh, house and lot selling. Have you, uh, Mr. Gorge and England, have you planned already which uh, place you want to live? Or I bet your wife like in his hometown, in her hometown in Lidoy. Mercy God, don't be shy, Sissy. We go together, maybe more enjoy. <laughs> yes, that sounds like, you know, um, enjoyable, you know. There are lots of friends, supporters, you know. Oh. What a life, Judai. What a life. <laughs> so how does 
how does with your new CR? Um, I'm gonna update that guys on my next day off. Um, but today Uncle Jonas will fix that because he had just only um had a time to work every Sunday in my our in our CR because he just had a job another job guys so today he was working and hopefully i will see that on my day off next day off i hope will finish yeah i think so it will finish because it's just a small cr that you know he will fix it so yeah we have looked it around the polog or bohol ah okay yeah sounds like i think you have to go visit first uh have a look around in the polog and or in bohol next and then that's the time you guys decide where do you want to live well that's that's a great decision, uh, Mr. Gorgian Ingman. Music San Diego. It's a lazy day. I just woke up, so not much going in that moment. I hear the rain there in your place. Does the air get colder when it rain, or just a warm rain? Um. Yeah. When it's raining, guys. When it's even it's not pouring rain but at least it went raining and you will feel it's not warm you feel like fresh or cold you know it's like um it's good it's not so warm so yeah when it's raining I feel like oh it's like cooler just like this but I still have a small fan because my room it's like uh, but it's not so warm guys yeah if you hear that raining and thunderstorm yeah it, it is feel more cooler because when it's raining I still let open the um, window so that it will you know feel more color i need more color but not snow <laughs> not snow yes i like to have like a bigger you know, size of lot we have a garden with ridges and fruits yes i mean um small house it's not kind of big house but they still have um a place or a backyard that you guys want to plant vegetable or flowers you know yeah that's that's nice mr gorgeous and we and we filipinos like to have a um plant vegetables in a yard No, I don't like to be in Liloy. Uh, yes, because it's been far from uh, the city, Liloy. It is good when you uh, live just around in the city. If a foreigner was come, if a foreigner was coming there for the first time. Where should they go? Where should they go? If you're first timer here guys, will you come visit to the Polo? Of course, the airport is here. And you have to ride in a trike. Um, I think you guys first visit here, have a look in the boulevard. Have a look in the sunset, you will enjoy. And lots of food in there, and lots of people will walk around. And after that, if you, yeah, there's uh, walking distance from the boulevard, the 
And if you want more, it's just here you have a lip plus a mall and a safe more. There are lots of it's not quite a big mall, but oh, that's our mall we had in the prologue. Yes, and if you want travel like um, go in a mountain or the, in the resort, you all you have to do you um, travel like an hour and you will see a nice resort, white sand beach. You know. From going to north, there are lots of white sand beach in there. And if you want also a nice pool in a resort. There are lots that you guys want to uh, visit here in the Polo. Jean Ducks eats. It's hard to shop online for a house from half world away. I've been looking for over two years and there's always something the referrals aren't telling you. Yes, I mean, it's hard when you're just only looking online, but uh, I think it, 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 uh, good ideas. I suggest you guys suggest that um, you will see in person in the land, you will um, have a look around first because when it's online and there's someone um, referring you. If you're not seen in person, I think you will say you will like it or not. So I think it's better when you go visit, have a look around, um, see the signals or everything, or you know. I think it's better that way when you have a look first before you decide to buy house in luck. Mr. Gorgian, Raja, you should visit Palawan Barakai, but more down by the monsters. Yes, it is. And of course, the Polo City, the Pitan, is a very nice place to be. Yes, and also, um, the Pitan, there's lots of nice beach also in there, if you want, guys. Just close to the Polo. Little Mark, I'm learning Tagalog and Bisaya right now, but it's very complicated for me. <laughs> My sister-in-law is Philippines from Mindanao, next to Kabad Baran. Ah, okay. I think that's speak Bisaya. <laughs> Once you're here in Mindanao, that's speak Bisaya. I think it might be hard for you to speak, uh, but once you're here already and you live and you stay in Mindanao I think you will know it, it's not hard I think guys once you were here <laughs> Rock Jam Rock uh, I'd like to visit the Philippines, South East Asia and Australia in a year or two Wow. Little my good evening and good night. I have to go work. Take care of you soon. Salamat. Mini for your video soon and God keep you. All right, Kim. Thank you so much for your time, Little Mark. Thank you for being here. Even you have a busy day, but you still have a time to see me in my life. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Anyway, thank you and God bless you. Stay safe, Mr. Little Mark. Yeah. So, I think anyone in here, guys? rain I hope it will stop before I go to bed because you know when I hear the noise of the rain I was awake guys I could not sleep just when I hear the noise of the rain I was awake
Yeah, I am still raining, but it's not like pouring rain. Good morning, Mikey. Phil D. It's hard to pronounce your name in here, but anyway, it's good to see you. Welcome to my live stream. How are you today? Jim Dukes. I was I was trying to find something along Dallas Beach and now QB told me there won't there won't be a Dallas Beach anymore since they extended the boulevard to Ulingan. Yes. I mean if you want um close beach to leave um Mr. Jean I think um have a look first in here once you've been here in in the prologue have a look around I think there you might uh want not only in Dallas but in some part of the prologue I think you will like it but have a look once you get back here in the prologue Yes, because um, I've seen like it's not been because at this side close to airport Dallas, at Dallas, I think it's not allowed. But when you go far there, um, far from Dallas, I think you can have. But I am not sure. You guys have a look at one day when you come back in the polo. Have a look around, um, Mister. Jean. The Philippines is starting to open up Marianne. Soon everything will open up for sure next year. Yes, I think so. We always say that hopefully, but yes, I think next year. But it's not uh, by... January, February or March, I think we will see that guys, but we will uh, wait what's What's an update for that? Hopefully it will soon By January or February or March, so, you know, we don't know guys, but with by the time that uh, will open the, the tourist guys that weather it's uh, good for you guys to travel because by month of March, April, May, that's summertime. So you will enjoy your vacation here in Philippines for that month. But hopefully, keep spraying finger cross one day, guys. Most people sleep better when it's raining. Yeah, I think so, but when you hear that noise, no, I could not sleep better with that noise, guys. I don't know. It's just we didn't hear a little bit noise. I was awake, so I could not sleep with that. So noisy with the rain. But when it's raining like this, you know, just some mild rain, that's like pouring rain. If you hear this one, yeah, that's better. But once it pouring rain, so noisy, and you know, I could not sleep. <laughs> the first part you got right, it's my vigil. Okay. Thank you for um, letting me pronounce your name. Alright guys, anyway. The rain was stop. I think it's good to have a rest because I have work tomorrow. And by Tuesday, it's my second job, Pfizer. So, yeah, hopefully, thanks God, everything is getting better. Um, and I think I need to have a rest. In a five minutes, guys, I'm gonna pack up because 
I need to rest, beauty rest, <laughs> I need to beauty rest, that's my beauty rest, sleep early, <laughs> sleep early, because the rain was stuck, if you hear that, okay, I'm gonna open the door, I'm gonna open the door, guys, because it's now, stop the rain, it will see. Yeah, it's good. The running was tough. All right, guys. Um, anyone would like to ask anything before I go? Good, my eyes. The rain washed up. It is nice to have a rest. It is it is stuck guys. night Marianne have a good sleep okay music San Diego thank you so much thank you for your time being here in my live stream thank you and you too have a good day enjoy your Sunday and the rest of your week and stay safe anyone would like to ask guys before I go And if you hear, if you want, if you hear, if you want, if you hear, if you hear that, it's now, um, it's now being quiet, the rain was stopped, so it's good to sleep because it's not warm, it's cooler. After rain, guys, it's good to sleep, it's warm, and it's not warm, it's cooler. Even no fun, still can sleep. Christian Pacardo, okay, welcome. It's good to see you, Christian. I'm about to go, but <laughs> you're, um, yeah, catch up the ZZ. <laughs> ZZ. It's ZZ time. I need to sleep because I need to work and I need to boost my energy, my immune system because I'm gonna have my second job on Tuesday. So, yeah, we'll see. Okay. The rain scared everyone away. <laughs> yes, they were scared. <laughs> the rain was scared because I said I'm gonna go sleep and you know, stop rain, <laughs> stop the rain. Yes, rest, rest in of my time because that's my beauty rest. <laughs> so if you do rest all right guys i think i need to go now and i'd like to say thank you so much everyone who joined my live stream tonight and i appreciate your time even you guys it's been too early you still have time to join okay someone's there I need to go as well get ready bring my daughter to us. Okay. Um, all right. I'd like to say thank you everyone who will join my live stream tonight. Thank you so much. I so appreciate your time. And hopefully we'll see you every Sunday at 9 p.m. Philippine time. Thank you so much guys. God bless and stay safe everyone. Good night.